Gulapma was also a woman of great spiritual attainments. She used to spend several hours in the morning and evening in meditation. The Holy Mother always spoke highly of the purity of her mind and considered her as having attained perfection in Japa. She was free from any exaggerated feminine shyness and therefore eminently fit to play the part of an intermediary between the Holy Mother and the devotees. Being very outspoken by nature, she would speak the plain truth to anybody's face. As a result, though she looked upon the Holy Mother with great reverence, she would not hesitate to take even her to task as a mother would her daughter. The mother often corrected her, telling her that in the name of the truth, she was losing sensitiveness to others' feelings and that sometimes it would be no sin not to speak an unpleasant truth.